talk about the Supreme Court ruling that is bad for art, but good for artists. Lynn Goldsmith, a photographer, took this photo of Prince on the left. Andy Warhol, who is Andy Warhol, made the silkscreen print on the right using Goldsmith's photo as reference. Goldsmith sued, saying that it was copyright infringement and Andy Warhol's foundation's defense was that, no, it's fair use. Prior to this case, the Second Circuit had a fairly liberal attitude towards what constituted fair use. For example, the image on the right was considered a fair use of the photograph on the left. Basically, anything that gives new meaning or new aesthetics or new expression to something was considered fair use. The Supreme Court rejected that argument, though, and held that because both images were used for magazines to run alongside articles, they had the same purpose and character. The decision is bad for art because it'll make it harder for you to take existing works, put your own spin on it, and monetize it. But it's good for artists because it'll mean that you, if someone does that to you, you'll get paid. If you want to learn more about this case and its implications, head over to my Substack.